Hello everyone, in this video we will learn about the concept of constructor overloading in C++. In C++ we can have more than one constructor in a class with same name of a class name as long as each has a different list of arguments. This concept is known as constructor overloading. Overloaded constructor having a same name exact the name of the class and different by number and type of arguments. A constructor is called depending upon the number and type of argument passed. When object of class is created, constructor called automatically. There is no need to call a constructor function. Let's see the code class abc abc is the name of the class and abc class having a private data member int a a is a private data member of the class and then define the constructor function constructor name is always same as the name of the class With the help of constructor function, we can initialize the member of the class. The value of a is 20, right? This constructor having no argument. This is a default constructor. Then after that, we have a parameterized constructor. Parameterized constructor name is also same as the name of the class. Parameterized constructor takes an argument. a is equal to x assign the value of x to a then the class having a display function void is a return type display is the name of the function display function display the value of a Then class body end with the closing curly braces and semicolon. Then inside the main function create the object of class. ABC is the name of the class. A1 is the name of the object. When object of class is created default constructor called automatically. First of all default constructor called automatically. Right. Then after that we have to call the parameterized constructor. Parameterized constructor take one parameter. Now when object of class is created, parameterized constructor called automatically. Right? Value 12 is copied into x and then value of x is copied into a with the help of parameterized constructor. Then after that we have to call the display function a1 dot display then after that a2 dot display display function display the value of a right in this code we have created a class abc right a is a data member of abc class right now when the object of class is created, in this class we have two constructor. First one is a default constructor, second one is a parameterized constructor. Right? When first object is created, the first constructor called automatically. When object A1 is created, then first constructor is called because we have not passed any argument. Right? This constructor initialize A to 20 right and when a2 object is created then second constructor is called right since we have passed 12 as an argument then this constructor initialize a to 12 
and then we have a display function display is a normal member function of the class then call the normal member function of the class with the help of object which is followed by dot operator when we have more than one constructor in a class with same name but different number of argument this concept is known as constructor overloading run this code now the, after the execution of this code the output is a is 20 then a is 12 when default constructor called the value of a is 20 when parameterized constructor called then value of a is 12 is to be printed onto the screen right this is all about the constructor overloading thank you